but say if you were finding your like four times tables tricky, then you could select the four times tables and then just play a lot of games to like do it. Or if you were struggling with your division, then you could do that. So you click on objects and then they come up with a question. Because you have to try and catch the treasure before it goes to the before it goes to Neptune's lookup. Because that's bigger, it'll go at the end and then you'll grab it. That's because that's smaller, you grab it there. No, because that's smaller than I believe that. Yes, so it had to go in place like, like that. I find it quite tricky. When I'm on this, it, I make, it makes it easier. It helps me revise my, um, my times tables. It's kind of fun at, what, at the same time and it's challenging at the same time. My favourite game is Some Search because it really like makes you think a lot and makes you find and learn more times tables. Because 6 times 8 is 48, you jump over there and then you um, jump on the dragon and then it goes to the cage. The games are fun and you can understand easier if, you, if it's fun. My favourite game is probably Cracker, cracker Safe because it's like, it's like telling you instructions, like add one, add a hundred, add, uh, well, add 58. It's like that, and then, like, like the, then like police that are just around the safe, and then, they have to try and catch you, and then you have to try and get all the jewellery. I like this, uh, this game because it's like, because I like doing like mazes and math puzzles, so it's basically the perfect combination. He helps you a lot with your maths in a fun way. We go and like just practice. Then when I go come back in the classroom, I know kind of what we're doing and like how to do it.